I was telling myself as I was trying to load these videos outside of Nordstrom, I said most people would have just went over there uh, to this lady's home where she said that she was raping my child with people. And people would have been fighting these people about this. But I said, then I end up right back in jail while people get away with raping my child from 22 months old. I'm saying it was, uh, imagine the type of people that are heinous enough to do that to a child's rectum and have no remorse for the child, feeling like you're retaliating on this child for a grown man's leg that was being violent with him because he's white and it's his father. She needs to be in chains and she possibly needs to be executed by the state. Okay, so I want to tell y'all, um, the people that are living in this building right here, 5151, they are trying to set me up. As I came out of the Macy's uh, parking deck, they are coming out trying to smoke cigarettes in my face, trying to get me to smoke cigarettes while pregnant to help cover up my pregnancy. And the people in that building, they were Caucasian male and female, they need to be investigated. So what they are trying to do is witchcraft by every time I'm, I'm walking somewhere, they're trying to smoke cigarettes and have the smoke going. They're trying to t drive past loud, but Cynthia Overa is claiming to be a nurse for 30 years. They're using their job history to cover up that they are pedophiles. Okay, so Cynthia Overa in the police department, the police officers that she said she was raping my child with, they are using their credentials, what you could call what pedigree, to cover up that they are rapists. So this coven that rapes these children, they said they were raping my child to death. They pride themselves on whatever they do for a living. And they want to try to have me in a jail cell knowing that they said they were raping my child or they want to try to have me dead or have the baby that I'm carrying dead possibly twins dead and have my son dead and then try to say that well she doesn't have a job or she doesn't have income but it doesn't change the fact that I don't rape kids and that you told me that you were raping kids I can testify against you at any point in time we need to know where the boy's body is where is my child you, you getting told on too much so all of the pedophiles in this coven are using work history. They're all trying to use some sort of work history or they're trying to use a degree. Uh, my family members that are involved are trying to use the fact that they have a job. Shakina is trying to use the fact that she has a job in a car to cover up that she's involved with raping children. Um, well, she said that she was letting Cynthia sodomize my child and setting me up to be killed. So that makes you an accomplice, which is why I'm saying that I'm going to press charges on you. J Even if you wasn't the one to rape him, you said that you was in on it and that she was in on setting me up to be killed, knowing that somebody was committing crimes like this against my child. And you're still involved with the operation to set me up outside while these people rape my child and I, I, we wasn't raised like that sweetheart you have to go to jail it don't matter what your job do your children got to say goodbye to you where is my son yeah I wanted to show quite a bit y'all I look good on TV bitch I look good I could easily take your place Easily. Babe, I look good in a motherfucker. Give me some hair and makeup. Like your whole said. I could be on TV, bitch. Okay, y'all. So, I want to tell y'all something about this poison sheet. First of all, let me show y'all. So, I want to get a gang indictment on some of these little bloods, gang member uh, celebrities that know about my pregnancy. These people over here trying to follow me up in the damn CBS and 
they've been poisoning food items that I've been buying out the store. They've been doing this to me and my son since Conroe, Texas, um, with the KKK. So, don't follow me up in no store trying to see what I'm buying and I'm pregnant. So that the manufacturers can try to poison the items. So that when the next time I come into the store to get the items, they'll be opened and resealed. And they've been a did something to me and my baby food that I'm carrying. Please wait. System processing. <laughs> So, um, what she did was she followed me around the entire store um, on her phone and she was laughing and trying to watch me the entire time. She refused to go to the counter and check out until she saw me getting my stuff. And she came walking past me to see what I put inside of my bag. And I had just got a Sprite. And what the Illuminati has been doing is having them people report um, that's been following me. Because every time I be thinking, oh, it's harmless, it ain't harmless. Because then they've been poisoning stuff. Um, they've been doing it in the Walmart right there on rice. They done opened up ice cream. They done opened up. Um, cookies, candy, chips, um, and at first I thought it was nothing until it started burning my throat. Now, I was walking past this whole house, and I decided that I needed to go ahead and show y'all um, how packed this whole house is. So, this, they packing up the whole house while covering up the rape of my child. That's the men's club. So they are packing up the whole house. That's the men's club while trying to set me up about Cynthia and them raping my child. And they out here trying to kill my baby. They got this CVS right here at the corner poisoning food. They got the Walmart down there poisoning the food. They got the Chipotle involved. They got that food mart involved. They got the subway involved. They got people in this neighborhood involved. Um, all the way down to the Regency Ho Hyatt Regency Hotel, the Double Tree. They're working out of the JW Marriott, the mall. And I've been sleeping right there at the bus stop. And they trying to, the celebrities in the country, they're trying to set me up like that. Um, and let this white woman gang rape my child for the Illuminati because I shot Austin and my family is trying to set me up like that as well and they're trying to follow me all over the country pregnant on foot poisoning me trying to smoke cigarettes to get me to smoke cigarettes pregnant and I'm not doing it and they are trying to try to intimidate me they're bothering me all night long speeding past the bus stop and they basically have all of the black people in the country trying to set me up outside knowing that I am with child peep the scene notice you just seen that black man he just came out of this Hilton garden in they are setting me up out of there too um but I want to give you guys an understanding of why they are trying to attack my image so bad. Um, I'm going to show y'all where they have me sleeping pregnant with my baby. Um, trying to cover up the pregnancy. And then trying to cover up them raping my child. So they want to make me look the part. And I'm not who they're trying to paint me out as. I'm a mother whose child they stole and they hate me and said that they were gang raping him. And the woman Cynthia Overa is not who she is portraying herself to be. 
She's trying to portray herself as a homemaker. She's trying to portray herself as his caregiver. She's trying to portray herself as a stay-at-home worker. Um, she has had a job, from as far as I know. I don't know if it's true. Uh, she probably has income records. But she is basically lying about who she really is in the spirit. She is a witch. And she is a child molester. So she has stolen my child. And the coven that she is in is desperately running around trying to set me up for her and for them because they wanted to rape him as well. It wasn't just Cynthia that said she was raping him. So here's this person. I need a knife because he's walking up on me and I done, sell, I done told him before to stay away from me. But see, this is the KKK. She said she was raping my baby with these men. So they're trying to stage me outside pregnant so they can all get away with gang raping my child. And she has to go to prison. But she needs to give up the names of all the men that she let rape my child because she knows who these men are. They threaten to kill. He's walking in step with me as I'm walking down the street. And they're coming down the street doing operations in this car. So um, this is where I've been sleeping pregnant. And this is why they are trying to ruin my image inside of the gallery of all. This is why Cardi B is talking shit. This is why Nicki Minaj is talking shit. And this is why Beyonce is talking shit. And it really let me know what kind of people they actually are. Because they know that these people said they were raping my child and they're in the gang and they need to go to prison. Nicki needs to go to prison. I understand that people might feel remorse. But I am pregnant. But because you're in the gang, you want to sacrifice me. And then you want to get mad because I'm actually a beautiful person. And I'm getting all of this media coverage that I'm putting out for myself. But they're so used to everything being about them. And it, it comes to the point where in order for me to really let y'all understand that I'm not playing with y'all. I will file charges on Beyonce Knowles for being in this game. And I will file charges on Cardi B. And I will file charges on Nicki Minaj and everybody else. And y'all can try to have me killed. I don't care. That is my child. And you don't go against Jesus Christ for Caucasians and for Satan. Thinking that you're going to win against God just because you've been selling your soul on this earth for money. I'm going to press the charges. If y'all don't make Cynthia come forward about my child, I'm going to start pressing. I'm going to start filing police reports on everybody and they think because the police have been raping kids with them. God ain't telling me to press charges for no reason. They're going to stick. When the right police get involved... Y'all can go to prison and y'all can go to jail. So y'all need to start pulling some strings to make this woman that's in this gang with y'all turn herself in before everybody go down.